NASA admits there's a chance that asteroid 2013 TX-68 could smash into the Earth. What's going on, guys? Make Electric. It is Saturday, the 27th of February, 2016. Be a video response to my video yesterday regarding 2013 TX-68 because some interesting stuff has come to light. Now, this article from the Mirror, uh, if you scroll down, it says, Humanity is expected to survive its close encounter with a space rock next week, but we're not out of the danger just yet. NASA has dramatically changed its mind about asteroid 2013 TX-68 100-foot-wide rock which is currently headed toward Earth. It said there is a chance it could plunge into our planet next year when it makes another flyby. Now you're saying that's more than a year away, plus, you know, the source and whatever. You know, Fusion put out a very interesting article. NASA is quietly planning for a disastrous asteroid to strike. Here's how. That just happened to come out on February 4th, 2016. Interesting timing. This is all in response to a GLP thread, by the way, and here we get into the meat of this video. NASA says asteroid TX-68 could smash into Earth, okay, 2017, but look at this. Space Weather removed it from the website. This is a GLP thread full of information. Let's take a look at Space Weather. Near Earth Asteroids. This is the archive for February 25, 2016. As you can see right down here, March 5, 2013 TX-68, 0.044 LD. Extremely close. That's lunar distance. Okay, let's fast forward one day. Look at this. Now it's March 8, so we go from the 5th to the 8th. What has transpired in 24 hours that, that makes these numbers so astronomical? And look at the distance now. 13 LD, that's 13 times the distance from the Earth to the Moon. So within 24 hours, we went to within our geosynchronous satellite range to 13 times the Moon. What's going on here, people? You know, because NASA still has the condition code at an 8. Here is the track, and they still have it on March 5, 2016. They're saying it's going to be 0 0.0015. 0 0.0015 is extremely close. And let me scroll down here. Yes, the condition code is still 8, which means they are highly uncertain of this asteroid's orbit and or the size of the asteroid. So how is it that space weather can make such a dramatic modification overnight? But the cherry on the top, take a look at this. Let's fast forward one more day. February 27, 2016, near-Earth asteroids. Well, all the data is missing. What the hell's going on here, people? Somebody just messing with us? These numbers change, you know, from the 5th to the 8th. Then the next day, there's no data at all. Were they told to take this data down? I would really like your input. Please rate this video. Please pass it around. Make people aware we could have a possible asteroid impact March 5, March 8. I don't know. Very strange goings on, though, wouldn't you say? You guys take care. Stay safe. Remain vigilant. I will see you on the next one.